former and a current state lawmaker from Niagara County have pleaded not guilty to charges in the latest corruption case to hit Albany. Good evening, everyone. Jackie is off tonight. State Senator Robert Ort and former State Senator George Maziars are both accused of violating election laws. Senator Maziars is also accused of using secret payments to cover up alleged sexual harassment. News 4's Luke Moretti has more about the charges they face. Luke? Yeah, the parade of public officials facing corruption charges moved through Albany once again. This time, a state senator and his predecessor from Western New York are facing felony charges. The allegations include secret campaign payments and a no-show job. Former state senator George Maziars, once considered a major power broker in Republican circles, is facing felony charges. According to the state attorney general's office, Maziars orchestrated a multi-layered pass-through scheme enabling him to use money from his own campaign committee and from the Niagara County Republican Committee to funnel secret campaign payments to a former Senate staffer who left government service amid charges of sexual harassment. According to court filings, the two committees paid the former staffer $49,000 in 2012 and $46,000 between 2013 and 2014. George Maziars is not guilty. He's pled not guilty and he looks forward to being vindicated in the courts. Earlier in the day, State Senator Robert Ort also appeared in Albany County Court. Not guilty. I'm fighting these charges. Ort is accused of participating in an illegal scheme to pad his taxpayer funded salary when he was mayor of North Tonawanda. It's alleged that Ort devised a pass through scheme to pay his wife for a job which he performed no actual work. State prosecutors say Ort's wife received about $21,000 from 2010 through 2014. I'm telling you as a lawyer that there is nothing to this charge. And this constitutes Schneiderman's list of false charges. And for him to bring these charges, for whatever reason, there is no basis to these charges. No-show jobs and secret payments are really uh, the lifeblood of public corruption. We've seen this before and we're out to stop it no matter where it occurs. Now both Maziars and Ort pleaded not guilty in connection with the felony indictments. Yesterday, former Niagara County Republican Chairman Henry Wotasek pleaded guilty on a misdemeanor charge of violating state election law. Luke Moretti, News 4.